What's up guys, Shad Juice here. Got a little Shad Juice in the back. We're about to go hit up some yard sales. There's a community sale today down in uh, Harrison, Ohio, which I don't think I've ever went to for some reason. But uh, we're gonna go check that out. Probably gonna get down there about quarter to eight, which is uh, later than I wanna be, but we'll see how things go and see what we find. Let's get it. I'm not sure the games. If you buy more, they're cheaper now. Okay. Pretty good, how are you? Pretty good. How much is the Xbox though? Uh, the Xbox and all the games, I'll take 30 bucks for all of it. Okay. The original Xbox, or if you got an Xbox already, a dollar a game. Okay. I'm just not 100% sure if the, uh, these older games, if they play in the newer consoles. So. Uh, I think they, there's a few that do. Yeah, I don't, maybe the not a whole lot. Like 360. Yeah. I think I've heard Ooh, some people right say. Now? Yeah, they upgraded to where a few would work. Did you really push me? No, I didn't. Look at all these army men. Cool, huh? Ask her up front. What's the price on the table there? I can't remember. Two. I prob she probably will ask her up there. Today's. What's up, guys? Shad Juice here, just checking in. You see, I'm still at that uh, big community sale down in Harrison. I've been here for like three hours. I'm letting the kid play on the jungle gym. I got some awesome stuff. Tons of vintage like toys. Like they said, her grandma used to sell at flea market. So. I got a bunch of like vintage toys, tons of video game stuff, which was surprising. So we did super good here today. So I got a whole carload of stuff. So just checking in. I ain't even hit like sales at houses or nothing yet. So we might do that for a little bit. But How much is the beer sign? I want to say 150. 150. Okay. Crazy. Hundred and fifty.
All right, guys, here's what I got at that first table that uh, I walked up to and I had a whole bunch of video games sitting there. I think I paid 20 bucks for the lot. We got SpongeBob, Battle of Bikini Bottom. If you didn't know, that's a good game. Thought that might be good, but it's like a $5 game. Untold Legends. We got WarioWare Smooth Moves. Pretty good disc. Got uh, Rugrats on 64. Toy Story 2. Buck Bumble, which is about a $13 game. I don't have that, I don't think. And the best game was Contra Hard Corps. You get about 30 bucks for that. You got a uh, PS2 uh, Clear Smoke Black uh, PS2 controller with the extender on there, I think. Got a silver PS2 controller. Put it back. And I thought this was a regular GameCube controller, which I didn't pay no attention at. And it's generic and ripped up, so we can burn that in the fire. And we are down at the cabin. My dad's cabin. Sneak peek of all the stuff I got. Come down here on the weekends, hang out, and get away from the city. Show a little bit of it. Well, we have to get it. Duh. 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 And there's another pickup. They had all these uh, Lord of the Rings sets. The Fellowship of the Ring, Two Towers, Return of the King. Another Two Towers, Return of the King. And another Fellowship of the Ring. I bought, a, it's like two complete sets worth. I bought them for eight bucks. More than I wanted to spend, but if I make something on it, I didn't even look them up. I'm not too big in the Lord of the Rings. Stack of Xbox 360 games. These are pretty good prices. Fight out round three, 50 cents. Quarter. Quarter. Probably get about 15 bucks for that. Evil with them was a dollar. Smash hits was a dollar. Silent Hill Homecoming, 50 cents. I got this at another sale. That was two bucks. That's at least a $20 game. Guitar Hero Warriors of Rock. That's another $15 game at least. We got Ultimate Alliance for 50 cents. We got Left 4 Dead for a dollar. And Harry Potter for a quarter. Real good deals on those games. Alright, here's another deal. If I, walk, I think it was on video I walked up and the guy had an Xbox original and some games and controllers. I didn't want all of it, so I grabbed some of it. Got all three of these controllers, the green ones. Sticks ain't perfect. As you can see, they're a little tore up. I pay like two dollars a piece for them. We've got some games. We got Project Gotham Racing 2, Forza Motorsports, Dukes of Hazard, Black, and uh, Test Drive Evil Destruction. I'm pretty sure that's worth money on the Xbox. I know it is on the PlayStation 2. Pretty scratchy, I didn't even look at it. Oh well. So we grabbed those for ten bucks. Three game, three controllers and five games. Let's see. Picked up this uh, Mike Tyson 2 disc knockout edition. It's got 19 throw pack fights. I might keep this and it actually goes for about $15 at least. So pretty cool. Got this Mario Kart for a dollar. Pretty scratched. I just got it because it was a dollar. Get it resurfaced. Little Mermaid on Blu ray for a dollar. Uh, this pickup was probably the best score of the day, value wise. Got this uh, DeWalt 1000 watt power inverter. Plugs in your cigarette lighter. It's pretty much brand new. They wanted 10 bucks. I tried for five, but they wouldn't take it, but 10 was a great deal. I don't think it's ever been used. The cord 
still wrapped up. Cord still wrapped up. I did plug it in. My cigarette lighter works. It's pretty nice. I might keep it. I don't know. Stuff like that you get so cheap and you can use it. Sometimes you got to keep it. But we'll see. Also got these two uh, radar detectors. Got a Bellatronics Vector V8 in the box, like new condition. And we got an Escort Solo S2. You can look them up if you want. That goes for about 75. I'm missing, uh, I think, the cord or whatever. Or maybe that's another window attachment. So I think it takes batteries, actually. Hopefully they're not corroded. I didn't look. Now they're good. Let's see if it turns on. Oh. Well, there we go. Cool. Definitely works. So we got... You said make an offer for them too. I said five bucks. I'm pretty sure I can get $75 a piece for that. So 150, another hundred there, 250 bucks for $15. That's probably just value wise the score of the day, but I got so much good stuff, guys. All right, guys, there's a cassette tape, tape lot I picked up. Uh, most of these were 10 cents. I think I paid a dollar for two of them at a prior sale. I paid a uh, dollar for Led Zeppelin II. And a dollar for Molly Cruz, shout out the devil. But the rest of these were 10 cents a piece. Got White Snake, Metallica Black. We got Anthrax, ACDC, Flick the Switch, Poison, Flesh and Blood. What's this? Stir. Like some of this, I don't know what it is. We got Rat, Reach for the Sky. Got another Motley Crew. Got some loose ones, Metallica, Ride the Lightning, Anthrax, Among the Living, Megadeth, Rust in Peace, Iron Maiden, Live Af Live After Death. Uh, we got Creams Reek, I guess that's how you say it. A couple Iron Maidens here, them are awesome. And Wasp. So what do I got? I think I paid like $3.50 for all those. It's a pretty solid deal right there. All right, uh, this was a guy that was set up right next to where I got the DeWalt power converter and stuff. And some vintage mask toys, which I love masks. I've been wanting some of these for a long time, especially this uh, like Bronco right here. So he had it listed, let's see, 858, that's 21. He had these listed for like 30 bucks. I said, what would be your best price? He said 10, so I thought that was fair probably keep them I don't know got this Jeep here and it shoots out the boat which is awesome That's cool. you didn't see that did you no check it out <laughs> why didn't it shoot out Before it shot out, got this little uh, car here. Got this, which is awesome. Ooh. Good old Kenner mask. This little guy here. So yeah, not a bad pickup for ten bucks. I'm happy this? with it. Can I have this? And uh, at that same booth, this is the second time around. I didn't even see it the first time. It was kind of like hidden. I think it was like sitting there like this. I was, I don't know, I didn't see it the first time, but it was a newer uh, 3DS. Got some wipes in there. This is the new, newer version. Oh, it's got a game in there too. All right, Mario Party Island Tour. I didn't even know that was in there. But yeah, it's got some more games in here in a second. He had an $80 price tag on it. I offered 50 and he took it. So this is like a new condition. And we got a... Uh, Mario Party, 3D Land, Mario Kart 7, Brain Age, Sonic Boom, Sonic Generations, and Kung Fu Panda. 
I'm guessing there's at least $150 here. So that was a great score for 50 bucks. And as a uh, like a generic power plug for it, but that'll work. All right, guys, this was a like a sale when I was leaving that big uh, community sale. He had some reel to reels. Most of them are recorded ones. He said he recorded all the stuff back in Vietnam. So uh, I don't know uh, what's that? Seals and Croft, Temptations, War, Isaac Hayes. But there's a bunch. There's a uh, 21 total. I think there's like yeah this is a new sealed one i ain't been used yet uh, let's see here there's some stuff on that one there's another new one i think this is just an empty real case yeah there was one man i wonder if now here it is a full three hour stereo program Take wing and the superb sounds of stereo. It's pretty cool. American Airlines. I don't know if that's worth anything. I didn't look it up, but uh, 21 reels and this uh, Blackbuster head cleaner, which was awesome. Got all that for three bucks. Great deal. All right, guys. I'm gonna keep most of this stuff on the ground, man. This one place had tons of like old retro toys. Said their grandma used to sell at the flea market. And like this is like mostly 70s and 80s stuff and it was like great prices so we're gonna try to finagle down here like some of the stuff i couldn't find prices for like this ma magnetic magic dancing dan we got that one like a yogi bear looking thing we got two of those don't know how much them are worth i've seen uh comps of this for 25 bucks but they're kind of beat up these spitballs, they shoot water. We got one, two, three of those. Those are like a buck a piece. I made a bundle deal with this. I'll tell you the total I paid for everything when I'm done. These Commando Ranger pieces. That was like 50 cents. Got Tyco Command Control Racetrack, brand new. It's pretty cool. These Bible Land action games. Some of the stuff I just bought, I have no idea what it's worth. Couldn't find no comps. Got a couple of them. Got some of these uh, dog plazas by Arger. Couldn't find no comps on this. They were pretty cool though. Got little toys in there. We got that one and two pink ones. But this stuff's awesome. These little metal mister uh, machine robos. I think I can get at least 25 30 bucks for these. We got three of them. Got this crazy clacker. We got two of those. Don't know how much they're worth. Couldn't find a uh, comp on them. This right here. Is worth at least 45 50 bucks. Dragon Riders of the Sticks. It's pretty cool. Kind of Mr. T ID set. Talladega Knights buttons. I'm just gonna lot all that together. So, uh, Bankable Buddies. Couldn't find a comp on that. Got this old goofy action toy by Disney. Couldn't find no comp on this either. Got this My First Buddies uh, Tub Buddy. Seen this old comp of 40 bucks on that. Benton's Mickey Mouse Puzzle, still brand new. Just let him play with it. Got these Wish World Kids stuff. A toll and roll clock turns into like a bowling alley. We got two of them. And we got a <laughs> treats and sweets refrigerator. What am I gonna shoot? All brand new uh, Kenner from 1987. 
got a Casper dart game. We got some uh, super robots by Faro Toys. Couldn't find no comps on these. Got three of them. The vintage Care Bear make it and bake it kits. Three of them. They can have one of these stores. A Care Bear's a, a Stair Mare, old Kenner Nursery. Like a lot of the stuff I couldn't find comps for. These are great. These uh, converters, mini motorized Maladroids. Can I have These go for at least 40, 50 bucks. Can we I got a red one and two blue ones. Can I have one? Hey guys, pardon the interruption in the video you're currently watching, but I wanted to do a giveaway for everybody that uh, you know keeps watching my videos. I really appreciate it. We've had a lot of new people and just wanted to give back a little bit. We got this Funko Pop here. It's uh, the Joker Batman Batman. It was a Loot Crate ex exclusive. So it's like a hybrid of Joker and Batman. I think it's pretty cool. All you got to do to win this, guys, is be subscribed to the channel, like this video, and you got to put a co uh, drop a comment in the comment section. It can be whatever you want. Just make something up. Uh, Say how you like the video or whatever, but that's all you got to do. And then uh, next week I will do a random comments comment search uh, drawing. One of them programs where you just it goes through the comments and a pixel one, and we'll have a winner. And uh, this could be yours. That's all you got to do. Thanks for watching. Let's watch the rest of the pickups. All right, I ran out of memory. Let's try to finish this up. Got these old vintage red sun visors. Pay like 50 cents a piece for them. There's four of them. Uh, what else do I get from that lot? This is crazy right here. All these vintage uh, Looney Tunes police, uh, police costumes. Halloween costumes. 1988. Tasmanian Devil. And we got Tweety Bird. Sweetie Bird, Taz, Sweetie Bird, Sweetie Bird. I end up paying like a buck a piece for these. This is a great deal on Halloween. It's coming right up. Oh, there's some different ones. I got whatever that is. And we got that girl there. So we got all of them. So we got 15 of them for 15 bucks. Definitely should do good on those. And we got this other huge bag of costumes or masks. Got a vintage Spider Man costume. Uh, I know I've seen a date 1987. We got all these old masks, all these uh, Ben Cooper masks. It's a whole bag of them. I think there were 33 pieces in there. We also got some of this stuff. These little yo-yos you can put together. One of those in there. What? Got two bags no, of them. Got these old vintage uh, Miller Lite headbands. And we got some uh, Heineken ones. Dollar bag. All these masks are cool. But you said... Nah, oh, yeah. I'm not getting this, but you gotta do this. Got this uh, wonderful element toothpaste dispenser. It's pretty cool. That's called an Encinco Calico Country Duck. It's on wheels. I don't feel like taking it out. On wheels? Put them back in there. I think that's about it, guys. I'm sorry, this has been a mess. Five of these Maxell uh, premium grades for a dollar. Just get about 30. Got this DeMarini bat. Double wall razor. That should go for about 50, 60. Got that for five bucks. And I think that's going to wrap it up.
No, you, if you pull, if your line have them tighten up or they bent like that, you know how when they bite. Hey Dundee, Dundee. What? You gonna get some crocodiles? Oh man. He's chopping weeds down with his machete. Look at that. Oh man. man. Chop them down. Show them what you got. Just want to say uh, thanks guys for watching. It's definitely a great haul today. Tons of vintage stuff, which I love finding. Appreciate you guys watching. Make sure you uh, comment, subscribe for that giveaway. So, uh, peace out. Thank you.